All right, fellas. So as you know, or well, maybe you don't, today is Sunday. Sunday, as as I said last week, Sunday is like our day to do some hard work to you know handcraft stuff and huh? And this is now my parents' office, mainly my mom's office, and we've been trying to get this all done nice and proper. My studio is upstairs, now they're downstairs. And um, look at this cable management. So, let's open that. All right. I believe I should try all the lighting setups to be sure it's gonna look good before I actually fix it. That's the same way it doesn't work, but if I reverse it, it works. So that's the point, I have to reverse the connection. And bam, I can use two male one. Good. Even a little too much. That's fine. If I if I did my job right, we shouldn't have harm this disc in any way. Looks good to me. And there is a temporary result. I haven't done everything, but down there so far it's clean. Here it's looking rather good. And we can remote control every light in the room, which is cool. Look at that! It smells so freaking good. Come here, little puppy. something about these lights. Anyway, um, you know, there's something I've, I wanted to show you for a while because I need that and when I said vlogging might be a distraction if you're not careful. On the opposite side, right now it's gonna be the proof that it's very positive. But let me clean the place first. So this. I bought that when I was DJing a bit for the fun because I used to grab this controller with this audio interface and audio interface are not made to be moved around all the time. Plus it's heavy, it's not very practical to DJ with that. So instead I bought this, which is also an audio interface. And I thought back in the days, you know, I'll be able to control all my loops on Ableton Live, except, except these are tiny pads, I only have eight of them, controlling Ableton, I could do it, that could be great, I could have knobs, and I could map everything the way I want, but I ended up asking for Christmas, actually, this puppy right here, which is much more convenient since it's exactly designed for Ableton Live. Now, you can actually... Hold on. 
can actually grab your USB cable, plug it in, turn on your audio setup. I oh, know this one was already on. Plus this one, gift from Arno. And well, I'll bring that back later. And once you have all that, you can actually, what is he asking now? Who cares? You can actually turn on Live to Twitch Translator to use that Twitch Twitch and simply turn on Live and I could actually try to make remixes because that's the whole point when you vlog you use music and so far I've been using the free uh, stuff you can download from YouTube which are royalty free that you can use with absolutely no problem if you're monetizing your videos and trying to make money out of it. Point being is I always need music and I don't want to pay for it. Yes. So I kind of understand now how to do this hip hop kind of style music, which I like more and more. And I try to use loops from songs, but I need some more content to, to feel all that. This guy is gonna help me do that. So I've got a little something uh, that I can show right now. It's not super good, but just to give you an example of how, how you can work this. So, um, yeah, I need to switch back to the main. All right. So, first of all, you need a beat. And I had, uh, oh god, I have to remember. I had the last one here for sure. I can't remember, I think this one. This one perhaps? That's what it sings. It has this one. I'm not sure if it's what it was this one, but whatever. And then you can bring this loop in. I could add some instruments. I'm not at full power, but I could make it. More music for tomorrow in the car. That is good. <laughs> <laughs> 